Here we go. Let's do a silly build. Silly, silly build. I'm thinking either summoners or something really crazy, like an egg, a two-star egg carry. Can it work? No. Can we make it work? Maybe. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Let's see what happens. Okay. Starting off with no units I really love. But I mean, I got a little goblo. <laughs> In the chat, uh, Toilet, you're saying we need to defeat this China menace. Well, the Chinese players won the World Cup of this game, the championship of this game, which doesn't surprise me at all. <laughs> They're clearly the best at this game. I think it's it's even made uh, there in China too. I'm pretty sure. Oh, that's a big jug of water. I'm drinking it all up. All right. Oh, I forgot to say hi, everybody. This is Jake, your resident content cowboy. Yeehaw. Like, comment, subscribe. Smash that smash button like it's Smash Brothers. It actually does mean so much to me when people do that. So thank you, thank you, thank you to everyone who does. And to everyone who doesn't, please, please do. Well, oh, Toilet, yeah, saying, uh, I'm streaming right now, so I have a, a chat going, and you're saying uh, we need to get Koreans on that to dethrone them. Koreans are some of the best, they have like the, one of the best gaming communities, obviously, in the world. I used to watch a lot of StarCraft, so they are uh, the best. Are they... Are, are, do they normally win League, or is is China big in League right now? I haven't followed League of Legends in a while, so I can't really say. Let's see. Ooh, I want everybody. Ah, okay, I definitely want Ripper, but I also want both God of Wars, and I also want Swordman. I'm just going to take the other God of War. This gives us our Goblin bonus right away. It gets us close to our mech, and I want... I want these God of Wars so that I can get a Divine Synergy and maybe we'll do some sort of Divine Summoner. But I have not watched a lot of competitive gaming in a long time. Merg saying, I watched a lot of StarCraft. I remember watching Husky StarCraft. Yeah. TLO and Huck. Oh, I loved Huck. I loved Huck. Um, <clears throat> there was that, uh, that female player that played Zerg that I really liked watching. I can't remember her name right now. Let's see, another Ripper. So I'm not sure what our build's gonna be yet. There's not a lot that I think is very good yet. And I, I should take an item here, but I don't love it, a lot of my options. Let's see. I'll take, uh, well, I want the ability for people to cast. What would I do if it was a summoner build? See, now I'm not sure if it's gonna be a summoner build or if it's going to be some ridiculous carry build. So right now, I'll grab Taboo Witcher just in case we start to go feathered. We'll see what happens. Scarlet! Yes, thank you, Scarlet. I remember watching her win that series. I thought that was really exciting. And what was that, uh, what was that Zerg player who was kind of like notoriously the worst? I can't remember his name. There was someone who played Zerg who was like, uh, <laughs> such an annoying dude. He was a great player, but he was just kind of, you know the worst sound off if you know who i'm talking about who's the zerg player who was just the worst okay i'm gonna move him like this let's see if we can get something going here now i don't want to go goblin even though it's being handed to me on a silver platter unicorn i mean I'm gonna I'm gonna possibly move down this feathered route and see who we're gonna grab. Idra, <laughs> Idra, yes, Idra. Man, I I loved watching professional StarCraft, and I you know StarCraft is a tough game because here with auto chess you've got to be good, really good to be good for sure. Um, but with StarCraft you don't only need to have good strategies and be able to adapt, you need to be fast with a mouse and keyboard boom 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 really quick on the keys really quick and i was never never good enough to compete but i loved watching it let's see what do i want to do here none of these people help any of the builds i'm looking for i think i'll just continue with what i got uh we lost that round 
you know, we could kind of middle here for a little bit, hopefully win some to pick up these gears. And I guess it's all going to depend on who we find. So, you know, this could transition into maybe some other kind of divine build, but I'd like to do summoners or I'd like to do a, a wonky carry, like an egg carry that you'd never use. I don't know what's going to happen here. I wonder what game I'd be playing if I grew up in a time where I thought being a professional gamer was a possibility. Because I kind of am too old for that to have been a real consideration. At least I felt like it. Okay, God of War and Warpwood Sage. All good units, source. Okay, what's our plan here, guys? We need a better plan. We have no plan. I want different units, but Warpwood Sage could be part of a good divine build. I don't know, I couldn't use him though, because if I wanted to summon, yeah, I'm gonna get rid of him. Source would, wouldn't be bad. I'll get rid of her. All the money is in MOBAs, I think, yes. I think MOBAs are the big money, right? What's, I mean, what are the biggest ones? The biggest tournaments have got to be League, Dota. I don't know what Fortnite pays. I, I don't know if they do really big competitive tournaments. I'm sure they have something. What, yeah, what is the biggest, what's the biggest esports payout? Biggest esports prize pool. Okay, let's see. I definitely want Whisper Seer, and I need these guys just to continue my build here. Um, Heaven Brew is not bad, just to give me some extra units. But this could be part of something going on here with these feathered units. We've got the make. We got the startings of a something happening. Oh, the largest prize pool is the Duo Fortnite Cup. Finals, $15 million is the largest prize pool. Oh, Counter-Strike. I used to play Counter-Strike. I remember when I was recruited as a... I finally got recruited as the alternate of this one clan. Um, and I was like, oh my god. I'm an alternate of these like guys who are good at this game. And uh, that was pretty cool. But I, I never really... I never really spent enough time with it to get good. Let's see. Skull Hunter, you are a summoner. We might be just going crazy divine summoners here. Then we need some more divine units. Um, I'd like to roll, please. Hmm. Well, this gives us a lot of our feathered. I'm going to go. We're going to move this into summoners here. Goddess of Light, we do need you. All right. So we can get our divine synergy. We can get two summoners out there. And then we just need to get him some levels and then unfortunately get rid of our mechs even though right now I would absolutely, if I was really trying to win, I would just push this goblin build, get rid of all this other nonsense that's not going to help us. I would go hard goblin, we'd start to win some early rounds, I'd, I'd pick items based on it, but uh, that's not what we're doing. We're trying to make a build that is not normally played. Let's get our summoners out there and try to summon. Ooh. We got some divine... Okay, this is just going to be crazy, but let's do it. You're going out there. 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 So now we got four divine. Four divine synergy. You guys can all go. I don't think they're even going to win this one encounter, but... <laughs> Okay, we're gonna go for a full-on summoner build. That's the plan. And hopefully we can get some mana items on these units and they can summon pretty fast. A life crystal is not what we're looking for. There we go, a magicka crystal. I could use you for sure. Ooh. Do I, I, do I pair it with a staff? I think I maybe pair it with a blink dagger. Yeah. Or a teleport dagger, as they say in this game. I always call it a blink dagger, but in this, it is a teleport dagger. So I'll maybe teleport you. 
<laughs> this is just so wacky. This isn't gonna work. Okay. What else could I take from here? A magicka staff. I could take a rune. Yeah, why not? Okay, I'll take a rune hammer. All right. And we need to find some units here. We need some people who... We need one more unit, which is our poisonous worm spawns units. And then we'll have our three summoners, and then we just need to level them. So we can start here getting our units leveled up. And then we'll be in okay shape, really. I mean, our cooldowns will be pretty intense, so hopefully if we start getting attacked and have enough life to deal with it, our units can just boom, 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 boom. Summon, 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 summon. It'll be pretty fun to see. Let's see. Uh, okay, yeah, I'll take Goddess of Light. I'm gonna roll a little. We need some people here. There's our Poisonous Worm. Well, we've got our Poisonous Worm. And... I need to get him out there. We're on a losing streak right now, though, so I'll do it next round. I'll, I'll see if we lose one more. Not spend a ton of money. Maybe even get over 50, because we've got 80 life. So maybe I just kind of chill here, let us lose a little bit, and save the money. Save the economy, as they say. I don't know who says that. I just did. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I don't think this is going to go well. <laughs> Let's see what we got. We just... All these units have to be level. We need a three-star druid. We need a three-star... Um, yes. Three-star skull hunter. And a three-star poisonous worm. If we have any shot of making this work at all. Which, you know, it's very possible we don't. It's very possible we don't. I don't think I'm going to take the Magicka Staff here. I think what I would probably take at this point is the Cattle Hide Armor. I don't think this is really going to help us too much, but I'll hold off for just a sec. Considering I'm not trying to win right now. If I was pushing a win streak, I'd take items that I thought I was going to combine and just move on. But considering we're fine with losing... I was going to say, this guy better beat us. Yeah, right? You're gonna win. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got you got your healing. Okay. <laughs> I might I'll probably switch Soul Devour. Well, I mean I could keep the Soul Devour, but I'm I'll probably switch him. Just with the uh the other one that I'm blanking on the name right now. I'm always blanking on the names. Nobody here helps us. Nobody here summons. I couldn't do, no, I can't do Insectoid. I'm thinking of like, what else could I summon on the battlefield? But I, I can't really do Insectoid because if they're paired up, you, they don't get the benefit of the Divine Synergy. So I think we'll have to keep it how it is. Okay, we're gonna go over 50 gold here. So now we can start just pushing, finding all our units. I wanna get us to level seven. And then I also want to roll for all these units. We're just going to keep leveling them, keep leveling them. And hopefully they can start summoning enough people to save us. <laughs> A full summoner build. It's fun sometimes to do something wacky. Nobody here helps us too much. And let's see. I think we're going to win this one. I'm not positive, to be honest. Um, but, yeah, we might not. <laughs> you never know. I don't know who else I would put down. Once I get past level eight, I feel like I'm gonna hang out at level seven or possibly level eight and you know, with like a doom or something. I'm, I think I'm gonna hang out there for a long time. I don't really see much of a reason with only a summoner build to do much else. You're gonna have to save everybody, God of War. I don't know if you can do it, but you gotta try to do it, brother. No, no, I think we're losing this one. <laughs> oh, this build, it's not so good. I mean, he is summoning a lot, right? That's what we wanted. Someone summoning a whole bunch. 
wooden club. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. All right. Got us a light. Sure, you can hang out. This puts us up to level seven, which gives us our poisonous worm. You are up here. You can come back here. Yeah, something like this. Doesn't really matter too much. Okay. Let's roll once. Whisper Seer. Yeah, we need you, brother. I'll swap some items onto Whisper Seer. Now that he's level two, we'll have him summon early, hopefully. And then we're going to keep rolling. Umbra's kind of like summoning, but I don't think it really counts. Look at all those little guys out there, all those little trees. We got a lot of them. Our trees are going to save us. It's working. It's working. Okay. So we got a lot of little trees going out there. For the time being, I'm going to give you that too, just because you're our guy. Let's see. No, none of this helps us. Let's roll a little bit. Sure, soul devour. Werewolf is kind of summoning, but I can't get werewolf and poisonous worm both out there or I lose my bonus. So I'm just going to have to say no. No thank you. One more roll. Unicorn again, huh? Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Here we are. Oh, this is uh, some tough, tough nights. I don't think we're going to win this one, but. Oh, the Ozflick. Hi, Ozflick. Thank you for the follow. I really appreciate it. You can watch me play a bad build, which is what we're doing. Oh, boy. And it got eaten up by that guy. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Uh, Razor Claw, I need you just to help us level, really. All right, let's see. No. No. All right, we're hanging out here. I don't want to spend gold if I don't have to. We still have 50 life, so I'd like to keep our life where it's at until we're getting a little more desperate, but I definitely need to two-star these units. We need to two-star our summoners. Ah, our summoner is getting his mana trained. He can't summon. Can't do the only job he's here to do. Oh, you've been watching the bad builds on YouTube. Right now I'm trying to do a divine summoner build. So I'm taking uh, the poisonous worm. I'm taking the whisper seer. And I'm taking, what, what's this guy's name again? The skull hunter. And I'm trying to see if we can win just using those three summoners and the divine synergy to help them summon a lot faster. We shall see. So far, eh, it's not working out. <laughs> but we kind of just got our build together. So, all right, let's see. Our golly Knight's just great, but do I move to eight with our Golly Knight? I mean, he's a great unit to have on a divine build. I'm, I might actually. It doesn't, it doesn't stop anything we've got, and he's a really good unit. We're a ways away from level 8, though. Let me roll here. Ooh, God of War. One more. Unicorn, God of War again. Well, grab you, grab you, sell these unicorns. These guys are just my people hanging out until I can... Ooh, we're just getting eaten alive! Uh, until I can get my Whisper Seer 3-star, which should be pretty soon. And now, 41 health. I think I might need something here. Let's see. Poisonous Worm. Soul Devourer. Unicorn again. Hey, there's Warpwood Sage. We do need you. All right, we can hold off for a sec. This is just a creep round. And soon enough, we'll have Skull Hunter and Poisonous Worm start up. So that'll be really nice. And we really need more mana. I need more mana for the... Poisonous Worm for sure. Three-star Poisonous Worm in this build would be so fun. It would be so cool to see. I think my health's getting low enough where I just have to start pushing these units even though I don't want I don't want to lose my 
interest advantage, but I, I don't think I'm going to have a choice here. I mean, especially we're losing <laughs> to all the creep rounds. We don't get to get the items we want because of that. So, yeah, I think we're going to have to do it. Can't put Dracula Mask on. Life Crystal. Okay. Right now, things are just going on him because he's our two-star little hero. Let's see. All right, I am going to level here. I don't like spending so much right now, but I'm just going to get our golly knight down there. Hmm. I'm going to move this guy a little bit. And now soon, our plan is we've got to two-star these other summoners. I'm going to have to do that next round, I think. Just at least have them two-starred so that they can live long enough to really get some summons out there. And so their summons are more useful. I mean, the Poisonous Worm, at two-star, good. At three-star, kind of nutty. And it would be really good to have that ability out there. Because otherwise, you know, he can summon all these guys, but they're not going to help us win. Can't believe this little guy. Little hero. All right. Unicorn again. Let's see who we can get. Come on. We need some of these people. So, Whisper Seer. Skull Hunter. Finally. There you are, buddy. Skull Hunter again. I mean, I would like to get him to three star if I can. Skull Hunter again. Wow. When it rains, it pours, huh? Well, I don't really want to drop any of these units just for a second. Oh, and Grim Touch is there too. Hmm. Oh, I actually only need three. Uh... Three druids, huh? Because I've got Wizard on the board. So I can actually uh, star up Whisper Seer like that. Cool. Poisonous worm. There we go. Things are happening. All right. All right. I'm not so stressed for a second. They're all two stars. That's cool. Everybody thinks that's cool. So I think we're in a good place with them all being two stars. Now the question is, do I even really want it to be Whisper Seer? I, I would kind of like to switch it and maybe have Poisonous Worm be the one who kind of flashes out there. But... At least giving him something. He's got to get something to increase his mana generation. Because he's just summoning too slow without anything to increase the amount of mana. I could get a source out there. Maybe I do need a source. Maybe I switch Argali Knight for a source. Just so these guys can get enough mana to continuously summon. Because without it, they can't, they can't do what they're here to do. 20 health. Well, now's time. Now's time. Okay. There's our Whisper Seer. If I put you down there and I put you down there, I'd star you up, sell you, sell you. I'm gonna swap our Golly Knight for Source. And I'm gonna keep rolling Skull Hunter. Hmm, hmm. We already got Grand Herald. Doom Arbiter is pretty good. Our Golly Knight still here. I could get a two-star Golly Knight and push us to level nine. We don't have the money for it yet. At least we're getting some three stars from the Whisper Seer. That's better. We're in a better position. I love our, our Poisonous Worm has enough mana, but that Doom stopped him from being able to, to cast. Look at that Whisper Seer going. It's actually working out having him right now because he's our three star, right? <laughs> So we got a little three-star tree action going on. But we're still falling behind. We're still behind on this build. I don't know if we need one more. Is it better to have one more unit or three-star the guys we have? And Because it's going to take a while to find three-star versions of all these units. Ooh, a draw! Hey! 
a draw. We're doing better. All right. I'll take a draw at this point. Okay. So we really want a Magicka Crystal. Uh, we really, really want a Magicka Crystal for our, our little poisonous worm here. And I think I'm going to need to keep this source out here. So that hopefully we can get enough mana to summon, I think. Because that's what this whole thing is dependent on, is having enough mana to put these units out there. And it actually works kind of okay when you have enough mana to summon all these units. It's not in any way a good build. I wouldn't say, but it's something. Okay. No, that's not what I'm looking for. But we're going to have to take what we can get, huh? Okay. Let's take another rune hammer. Combine this. Put that on you. And I don't even like this. <laughs> but I'm gonna do it. Okay, 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 okay. So we're in trouble, still in trouble. We got our summoners. That source could be two starred. I mean, it's nice against the this. We're, we happen to just be casting a lot, and we got a lot of units coming out, so it's working out pretty good here. I mean, this is gonna be a lot of damage to this guy. Right? What? What? How much was it? I didn't even see. Oh, were we fighting a copy? That person might have gotten very lucky. Ooh, we got our golly knight. I am going to push this here to level 9. And the reasoning is uh, we're, our health is so low that I'm getting this guy out there. He doesn't complete a synergy, so he gets to cast really, really fast, just kind of like everybody else with this divine synergy. And now, now there's no question that I need, I think I definitely need that source to level up so that we can cast more, absolutely. We just need more mana. We need to be able to cast faster because our cooldowns are coming up, but we don't have the mana to cast. So I need that source to level up. Magic staff and a lucky coin. Okay, not bad. Not bad at all. Not good, but not bad. We're doing okay. We're not freaking out. No one's worried. I'm not worried. Are you worried? Okay, I'm gonna put this on maybe you. Do you have an empty space? Okay, you're full. I'm gonna put this on our golly knight for sure. You could probably use some more of what's on this guy, but all right. Do we roll? Do we roll? Do we roll? We're really only looking for source and god of war right now. I don't think we're gonna lose 20 health in one round. I don't think. <laughs> But you never know. Uh, you gotta cast, our golly knight. You gotta cast, buddy. We need you to heal everyone. Look at our golly knight. The hero. Ooh, this is not good for us, I don't think. I think we're dying here. Not like dying, dying, but yeah, losing it. How bad? How bad is it? How bad is it? 10 health. Okay. Bad. We're rolling. Source. Unicorn. Skull Hunter. God of War. Three star. That's something. It's definitely something. It's not nothing. So for everyone who's saying it's nothing, you're wrong. It's something. We've got something. Oh, God, we lost this guy three times. <laughs> this is probably it. Well, I think we're heroic, and I think we tried our best. And I don't think anyone can blame us for trying our best. 
They can only say that they respect us and they think we're great for trying hard and battling on in the face of adversity. Mm. One health! We have one health! Okay. One health. I would love to get uh, a source here soon and I would also love to get a three-star skull hunter. I think my positioning might be bad for taking those massive blasts from the mages, but at the same time, I worry that if I move a lot of these units out of this pocket, <laughs> yeah, one health and a dream. If I move a lot of these units out of this pocket, I worry that they're not going to be able to be protected by, you know, God of War, and they're not going to get healing from Margali Knight, but, you know, we might not have a choice here. Got a resistance cloak. Yeah. Can we get some mana, please? I'm begging you. Okay, well, uh, I'm going to have to take this staff, I think. Or do I have anything that can combine to one of these items? I'm just going to do this because it's a legendary tier item. And I'm going to give it to our golly knight, I think. Okay. Let's see. Skull Hunter. Oh, wow. It's too bad. We're so close to getting this Skull Hunter, but I just, I don't think we can survive the onslaught from these builds, unfortunately. Oh, did we survive this one? Did we push through? Look at all those units. Look at all these summons. How much damage did we just do? Whoa, we killed him. Wow. Over 25 damage. I didn't I don't know how much it was, but wow. Wasn't that something? That was something. Okay. Sacred Lancer, you don't really do much for us. Source. Sell the unicorns. There's another poisonous worm I can't grab. I was gonna roll down and see if I could get this Skull Hunter, but I'm not finding our three-star Skull Hunter, unfortunately. Wow. Wow, this magic is just eating us alive. Yeah, this is it for us. We died, we died how we lived, with honor. Third place. You know what? Honestly, not too bad. Not too bad. I, I didn't expect us to get that far. And I think that was pretty fun to see. And when it really got chaotic with a ton of those units out there, I thought that was pretty cool. I think there were probably some things that we could do to make that easier. And also, had we gotten more mana crystals, I think we could have lost less HP as we were going. It would have been really nice to get items that helped our units cast, but we just never really found them. Uh, that's why we needed that source out there. So there we go. A divine summoner build. We saw how good it went. Third place. Not bad. Thanks for watching or listening. I'll see you next time. Mwah! Great.